two, one! <gasps> okay. Oh, it's 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 growing. Did we did we run? Hi, I'm Julia. And I'm Alex. And here at KiwiCo, we create projects for you to build at home. So we have to think big, but design small to get everything you need into a box. But from time to time, Alex and I like to challenge ourselves to take on bigger projects, like when we made a super-sized egg drop or a giant pumpkin launcher. And this time, we're hoping to do a giant chemical reaction. Like, so big. So big. So big. And to do that, we're going to need to do some experiments first. So KiwiCo has some awesome chemistry projects where you can explore concepts in a super fun, hands-on way. Like the Vortex Lab where you can play with diffusion and solubility, and the Electrochemistry Lab where you can explore oxidation. Both of those projects show a chemical reaction in action, which is when two things mix, change, and create something new. So I have some baking soda in this beaker and some vinegar that I dyed blue so we can see it in this beaker. So this is a chemical reaction. These two substances mixed together, created something new, and a bunch of bubbles, and we love bubbles. This is a pretty small chemical reaction, but I heard Julia's working on something called elephant toothpaste, which she thinks could be a bit bigger and perfect for what we're looking for. Hey, I brought a giant toothbrush. Wow, that is a very large toothbrush. I know! I should have clarified that there is no toothpaste involved. It just looks like toothpaste. I'm very sorry. Ooh. Oh, I should have done more research. That's okay. I'll <laughs> use this for something else. <laughs> I'm sure we will. Okay, so put these on for safety. Oh, cool. So in this flask, we have hydrogen peroxide, which is a chemical mm -hmm. mixed with dish soap. And then we have another chemical called potassium iodide. Potassium iodide. In this beaker. So when we mix them, cool things will happen. Okay, cool. And Let's that's do it. A reaction. You ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, blast off. Wait for it. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. Pretty cool, right? This is perfect. What's cool about this reaction is that it's really scalable. We can make it really big. Like how big you talking? Uh, like. Really, really big. Okay, sweet. So now we just need to design a big enough beaker. Let's do it. All right. It was like, yeah. With the experiment figured out, we got to work designing our giant beaker. Here's what we came up with. Attached to the sides of this massive beaker are 15 giant buckets. The buckets will hold the potassium iodide while the hydrogen peroxide and soap will go in the bottom of the beaker. Then we'll add a system to release the buckets remotely. When that happens, they'll all get dumped into the bottom of the beaker and the reaction will start. With the design all figured out, we called in some friends to help us build it. Today's the big day. The giant elephant toothpaste explosion day. So we haven't seen the setup yet, but I heard it's pretty big. I heard it's elephant sized. Should we go check it out? Yeah, let's go, race it. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. It's so big. It's huge. This reaction is going to be basically instantaneous. So we're gonna be observing from a safe distance and wearing some very fun personal protective gear. These chemicals can also be kind of dangerous when we're using them in such huge quantities. So we called in professionals to handle all that stuff for us. So everything's gonna be super safe. Yeah, let's get suited up. Are you ready? What is this? We said fun protective gear. I'll go change. We're up on the platform. Looks like we're about to do the countdown. Check it out! <laughs> Three, two, one! <gasps> okay, I see it. Oh, it's oh, rising. It's rising. It's rising. It's spilling over. There's oh so my gosh. Much of it. 
Oh my gosh. Oh me. Oh, it's 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 growing. Do we run? <laughs> oh, I think it's slowing down. We're good. We're okay, good. okay, okay, okay. It's huge. <laughs> yeah, that is not small. It is amazing how big this is given, I mean, the beaker was huge, but the beaker compared to this, it's like what, 10 times the size? Yeah, and it's still growing. I think it's safe to say we accomplished our goal of creating a giant chemical reaction. Definitely, and we had so much fun and we learned so much along the way. For more chemistry projects, go to kiwico.com. See, See you, you next time. time. I think we might need a bigger toothbrush.